Hey y'all, hey y'all, it's DJ the Diva coming at you again. I just wanted to uh, come back and do a video to elaborate more on what I'm doing in order to lose weight, to get healthier, to get, to eat cleaner. Um, some of the tools that I found, see that waistline coming in y'all? Y'all see that waistline? See that waistline? Yes, yes. <laughs> but seriously, check out the hair. Like I said, I tied it down for a minute. And you see, it's really, really neat, nice. And it did not take a lot of effort or I didn't have to use clips, pens, nothing. Okay, so just check out my previous video and you'll see that. How to retwist your hair without using clips. All right. And it's a lot quicker to get done. Um, I got tools that I needed in order to help me obtain my goals. Um, I'm eating clean. I'm counting my calories. I'm um, watching my portion control. And I'm drinking tons and tons of water. Speaking of water... Let me, okay, you see that? That says purified drinking water. This is just, and I learned this, but since I have so many, I'm going to go ahead and drink these, and then I'm going to switch over to spring. Whenever it says spring water on there, you know, on the back, it will tell you from which spring it came and what state it came from. Um, and in the ingredients, it will just say spring water from this certain spring in this certain state. Um, this is just tap water that they've filtered. Um, so that's the difference in drinking water. Is there a difference in the taste? I think so. Um, the spring water tastes more like... Um, Oh, tastes more pure. It just, it tastes more pure. Um, see, this says drinking, purified drinking water with flavor enhancing minerals. Okay. We, when you know better, you do better. So I will go back and get some of that, I think it's called Deer Lakes Spring Water, and it came from a spring in Pennsylvania, which I'm from Pennsylvania. So, yeah. Ingredients, purified water, calcium chloride, and sodium bicarbonate. I'm going to drink it because I bought it, and I have about 90 more of these, and it's going to be drank, but... When you know better, you do better. And I will be getting spring water. Um, or distilled. Yes. Now, another tool I found that helps me a lot is flavored packets. When I get tired of just drinking water, 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 and I want some flavor, but I don't want to add it calories because that's one of my problems. Um, when I'm eating this stuff, I drink a lot, and I drink most of my calories. Um, so, I found these little f flavored packets, I think by Weiler's, and it's like sugar-free, and it has two flavors that I've tried that I liked, and they are both Jolly Rancher, Watermelon Jolly Rancher and Green Apple Jolly Rancher. Yum, 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 yum. Yes, and it's only five calories per packet, and one packet goes in each bottled water. So, yes, that's a staple for me. Um, veggie straws. I got a pack of veggie straws, and you can eat 36 veggie straws, and it's 130 calories. That's good. Um, that's a good snack also. Speaking of snacks, I found a few things at Aldi's that I didn't expect to find. 
that um, is serving me well with my new lifestyle. Um, one thing is this snack on the go container. You see that? Let me try to pull this off so you guys can see. It's pre-portioned where you can have your fruit or vegetable here and your choice of dip here. It's no bigger than a butter dish. It's plastic. Um, it seals very well, as you can see. I'm trying to get it open. I'm trying to get this open. Well, we shall figure it out. There we go. I want you guys to see how deep this goes. A nice size. On the go, take it to work for lunch. That way you are not overeating or stopping for fast food like I did today. Portion control sized. Um, one, snack, one section for snacks and the other for dips. Ideal for quick snacks at school, work, picnics, and more. This is designed to keep your snacking at 100 calories or less. The next thing I got was this container. And I wrote on it because I took the, the packaging off of it. But this is a collapsible portion control plate. Um, let me tell you, I got this at Aldi's, this one at Aldi's, and it was only $1.99. Can you believe that? Just $1.99. Very helpful. This one I also got at Aldi's. And this was $4.99. I'm going to go back and get another one. But this is like Tupperware. You see the sides? It seals. Okay. All four sides. And uh, on the packaging, it told you what was for what. So I just took a permanent Sharpie. And I wrote on there, you know, two cups of protein or grain, 1.5 cups of veggies, and one cup of fruit. And that's what it fits in there. This is the container. This is the lid for the container. And let me show you this container. See this container? It's so neat. It's collapsible. Look at that. You know, you fill your stuff up, put your lid on, put your lid on, and then when you get done and you eat everything, yum, 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 space saver in your lunch box or your bag or your lunch bag or your purse, whatever. Collapsible. Look at that. $4.99. $4.99. I thought that was a great deal. Teaches portion control. And then, like at home, I have those. I bought those kitty plates with the kitty spoons and forks. And they, they're sectioned off. So that's a good thing for home for portion control. But when you're out and away and you have to take stuff to go, this is a lifesaver. And that was $4.99 at Audi's. Another thing I got was this wellness plant. When I tell you I got my whole life with this book, I this journal, I did. Um, it has quick referencing, and it's pretty. It's really pretty. Um, quick referencing, you can put your information and some of your family's information. Um, this, and this is designed to take with you wherever you go. Um, they have contacts, telephone numbers you don't, you know, remember from heart, goal writing. Um, 
it, it, it's a guide. It tells you, get specific. Your goals should be clear and well-defined. Use action words. Use measures. Your goals should include a way to evaluate them by using dates, times, precise amounts, etc. Choose obtainable goals. Make relevant goals. Set time boundaries. Appreciate your progress. And then it has like inspirational quotes that say, a dream written down with a date becomes a goal. A goal broken down into steps become plan. A plan backed by action makes your dreams come true. And then they have a spot where you have yearly goals. This year I want um, how they have a page. How are you feeling? What are your life's goals for three months, six months, 12 months? A lifetime, five years, hopes and dreams. Um, they have a place for pictures for your starting points. Um, inspirational quotes, positive mind, positive vibes, positive life. Um, let's see, what else? Um, calendar, so you can write down everything. You know, exercise goals, inspiration. This month I want to what? You know, and mine was eat less, eat clean, drink more water, and start moving around more. Um, it has places where you can mark off every day. You know, it has droplets there. I don't know if you guys can see that. Where you mark off how much water you've drank, um, how much sleep you got, your food log, your motivation, what you're grateful for, accomplishments, weekly tasks. Um, like this quote here, don't work out so you can love your body. Work out because you love your body. Very, very nice. And then at the end of each month, it has a thing for monthly progress. Um, what else does it have? I love this book because it's inspirational and it guides you to not only be healthier, but to be a whole person, mind, body, soul, a complete person within yourself, healthy inside and out, physical, emotional, mental, and spiritual. I just love it. And it was at Aldi's for $7.99. Um, be strong, be brave, be fearless. Make life epic. Um, you can do this. A running log, a workout tracker. Um, weight, loss prog weight loss progress. Three month check-in. A reflection. What worked, what didn't work. Um... Thoughts and notes, who I want to become, you know, I really, really, really like that. And like I said, I found that at Aldi's discount store for $7.99. Um, I got me a new uh, Fitbit. Uh, mine had broke and I tried a Q7 or something from JCPenney's. Hated it hated it you know it did nothing like it said it would do it didn't keep up with my steps um it didn't charge so well or anything so wasted thirty dollars okay um so i said let me quit messing around and let me just go and i did research and everything and at walmart i found the best price um hundred dollars and then I got the insurance and I think maybe that was, I think altogether it came to 116. You know, why keep buying these off cheap brands when it's just a waste of money? Just get what you want from the start and you end up saving money anyway. So I got this one working well. Um, pulse, uh, food tracker, water tracker, workout tracker. <laughs> you know, 
the works and I love it and it's waterproof so I can go swimming with it or what have you but I don't have to worry about if it gets a little wet or whatever okay um what else oh you know I, I'm flushing all this out with the water and stuff so I want to put something healthy back in so I got me some hair skin and nail gummies so yeah these are good. I just take two every night. Two every night along with my um, uh, physician prescribed vitamin D. Okay. Um, what else do I do? Um, I started really, 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 really taking care of my skin. Um, I love Dove. Okay. And I love uh, Vaseline and Jergens. Um, I'm trying out Gold Bond for dry skin because I get an eczema and dry skin. And what I'm trying to do is lay back off of some of the prescriptions I'm prescribed. So yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm working with it, but yeah, so far so good. I like it. Um, what else? Oh, new contacts. I, for the last like month and a half, I've been trying different contact lenses. Um, because when you have cancer, it, messes with every fiber of your being and my eyesight has gotten worse like double what it was before so i've been i've tried like three or four different brands kinds strengths of um contact lenses and i have dailies in now i have a different prescription in each eye which means you know i started with the lowest ones um, like the AccuView, the Fresh Look. I went to the Ultra um, by Bao Shalom. And now I'm in the most expensive. And wouldn't you know, they work for me. So I got a different prescription in each eye. So it's going to be 125 for each prescription for a three-month supply, which I don't care as long as I can see, you know. But, um... Yeah, I thought I'd bring you guys along with me as I take them out. They're super soft and super easy to put in, but they're a little bit slippery to take out. So, um, this is my fourth day. So, it's time for me to take them out now. So, um, just bear with me here as we go in to take these out. And like I said, look at that. They're dailies. So they get disposed of daily. They probably could stretch, as my doctor said, but she wouldn't suggest it because after a day, they start to break down and disintegrate. So your girl won't be doing that. And these are slippery. Let me get this one out here. I don't know. For some reason, I always have trouble with this one. This one eye. The left one. There we go that really thin can you see that really thin really soft and I probably could you know stretch that out for one more day but I do not want to chance it so let me wipe this eye 
and throw it away. And we'll be putting a new one in in the morning. But see, um, I, I have to get my jush, you know. I have to find what works for me to get them out quicker or whatever. And that takes just takes practice. But yeah, those are really working for me. They're called dailies. I go to um, Dr. Scott and Walmart Vision Center in North for Sales, Pennsylvania. The best doctor, I'm telling you, the best eye doctor. I haven't found one that takes care of me and takes the time and explains and um, very, very patient, very, very professional, clean, and very personable, and I love her. So if you're in the Pittsburgh area, trot off to North for Sales Walmart Vision Center and make an appointment with Dr. Scott. You will not regret it. Okay. But, yeah, those are the things. Um, I got some granola bars um, that are anywhere from 60 to 100 calories a bar. I haven't eaten them. Um, one thing I have to realize is I still have braces. So... Locks and braces, honey. And um, there are certain things that I can't eat. Uh, I love, love, love salad. But the lettuce and stuff sticks in there and it gets slippery. It grosses me out. But I'll eat my salad. Then I'll just hurry up and go brush my teeth. Because I have to brush so often anyway because I have braces. And stuff gets stuck in there. I don't want any cavities or anything. Um, I'm trying to think what other snack. Oh, Walmart has great value light yogurt that's six ounces, 80 calories. And I got the peach and strawberry banana kind. Yum, yum, yum. I use that as a night snack because I, I'm used to as <laughs> from a child. Thanks, mom. Um, having a night snack. So that is good for that. Also, um, two teaspoons of cottage cheese and two apricot halves. Mm, I love that. Yeah, that's a light snack. Um, and that's a snack during the day that I enjoy also. Um, I'm trying to eat cleaner. So like today I had the veggie power bowl from Taco Bell and it was... 360 calories and no it was 460 calories and then for dinner I had uh, Wendy's grilled chicken spicy chicken wrap and it was 360 calories and I had a peach uh, light yogurt and it was 80 calories and I got me some veggie straws which were 36 for 130 calories. I didn't even need half of it. I was so full. So, yeah. Water, water, water. Um, and that's all I'll do for the rest of the night is water. Um, I might walk up and down my steps a couple more times. So, my goal right now is just to hit 10,000 steps a day until my body gets used to activity again. For right now, I can't work out. All I can do is walk. Um, but I'll tell you one thing I did do. Today I started, because I love to dance, I started looking up videos on YouTube about line dancing. I did the wobble, I did the electric slide, and I did the cha-cha slide. That was a good enough workout for me. Um, I didn't do a whole bunch of hopping and stuff, but I moved. And that was my main goal for this month was to, and my hardest thing was portion control and eating cleaner, which I'm doing. It helped that I had the flu and I didn't eat for three days, 
but I slowly, when I slowly started eating again, I started eating clean. So, and I started doing intermittent fasting because that let me see that I was more than capable of doing intermittent fasting, especially since I'm not a breakfast eater. Um, so I eat around 12. I stop eating at 6.30. Um, and like it's, it's 7.30. So I, I'm doing good one day at a time. Um, some days I'm hungrier than others. Some days I'll just have one meal a day with two snacks. That's okay. That's okay. I have to listen to my body. Um, and my snacks are usually fruit or a hummus dip with a vegetable. That's just what I'm doing these days. Sometimes when I'm not that hungry, my one meal a day is, you know those salad packs that you can buy in a store and it'll say Southwest salad, kale salad or whatever. Well, the whole bag is like 450 calories. So I'll get that, throw it in a bowl, add me some tomatoes and onions to it and just mix it up and I'll eat that whole thing for my dinner. So what? It's only 450 calories or 500 calories. It filled me up. And the rest of the day, I just drink water. You know, um, I don't push myself to eat when I'm not hungry anymore because my body can handle it. <laughs> you know, my body can handle it. So I'm grateful, almost grateful that I got sick because it showed me that I was stronger and more capable of what I, than what I thought I was. Um, my cancer kind of crippled me in a way. And that's one thing why I had stepped back from social media because I had to get me together. I'm still getting me together, so I won't have a lot of videos like I was doing on here because I'm still working on me inside and out. Um, I'm not the same person I was before cancer. I'm not going to be, but I have to learn the new me. I have to learn new ways of doing things and adopting things because I still go through symptoms. I'm still in recovery. Um, I'm still seeing doctors. I'm, I'm, my body has completely changed, you know, and I have to be okay with me. I have to learn to deal with and love and learn and be kind to the new me. So that's where I'm at. Um, I thank you so much for watching my videos. Act blessed, talk blessed, walk blessed, and be a blessing to who? Be a blessing to the Lord by blessing somebody else. This is DJ the Diva, and I'm out. I thank you so much for watching my videos. Please click that like and subscribe button. Support a sister! <laughs> I see you guys viewing. Start subscribing. Let's support one another. Um, I love you guys to life. Um, I don't know when it'll be the next time I post another video. It might be a week or two. But I want you guys to know I love and appreciate you. I thank you for your well wishes and your prayers. If you have any suggestions, just put it in the comment box below. Um... Yeah, and I will be watching you guys' videos, getting inspiration from you guys. Um, some of you guys don't know how much you have touched my life with your videos, with your comments, with your encouragements, with your prayers. And I surely appreciate it. I just want to say thank you. Bye. Love you to life. This is DJ Diva. And I'm out.